Hi, my name's Genevieve. I'm an MRAG art tutor, and today I'm going to show you how to make a rainbow bouquet, just like this. So this is inspired by the exhibition Waiting for Equality and the wonderful rainbow families in our community. So to celebrate that, we're going to make these little beauties, but how are we going to do that, you say? Well, I'm going to show you how. We need to collect our materials. We'll need scissors, sticky tape, glue, a pencil, paddle pop sticks, some scrap paper. You could use magazine papers if you don't have any lovely scrap pieces like this. And we'll need a Vegemite lid or any lid will do or maybe a jar or a cup. Just something that we can get a nice circle with. First, I'm going to show you how to make this flower. So to start, we take our Vegemite lid, or in your case, it might be a cup or a glass, and we draw around the lid like so. Ta -da! Then we cut our circle. And once we've cut our circle, we're going to snip the edges like that. And you keep working your way around just like that there we go so now we want to make our centerpiece in our flower so I'm going to use some yellow paper so I'm going to make a circle oh, maybe about this big you can just guess I cut that one out I'm just gonna Draw some pollen, boop, 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 just like that. And then we want to make our leaves. So just draw them. So you do like that. And then a line up the middle. And we cut those out. So now we have all the parts of our flower. What we want to do is we want to glue this little line, stick it down. Then we want to get our paddle pop stick and we turn our flower over, put the paddle pop stick down, and we, whoops. Sticky tape down the flower and get our leaves. Just make sure that your drawing is on the outside like that. Stick them down. And the sticky tape. Just like that. And then what you want to do is you just want to kind of fluff your petals a little bit. Ta -da! There is our flower. So you can decorate them any way you like, as I've done here. So as you can see, we've got lots of different flowers here. So once you've done one, you can experiment with different paper folding, some lovely paper collage, and you can use lots of different materials. So have fun making your bouquet.